This is my collection of antique harpsichords and clavichords, and there are now 11 harpsichords in this collection, ranging from one that was made in 1570, is the earliest one. But the latest one is 1779. You have to make sure that the case and all the working parts are good so that the soundboard is, is good, the, uh, the jacks and the uh, keyboards work well. Then, but you also have to do painting restoration if there's uh, paintings involved in it. Even the maker's rose, which is found on the soundboard, um, they're, sometimes they're made of tin, sometimes they're made of uh, cut paper and um, those you sometimes have to restore. The quality of restorations has really improved in the last 10 years. And the instruments that we have now are these amazing antiques. I mean, this one was built in 1627, and it works as if it came off the, the, the factory floor yesterday. You know, it's, it's just perfect, in perfect working order but with this extraordinary tone quality that comes from being, in fact, nearly 400 years old. This collection is really unique in North America because not only do you have instruments of so many different kinds, each one is completely different. Uh, the number of keyboards it has, how many notes on the keyboard, what are the strings made of, um, that completely affects the sound of the instrument. So you have to learn to play differently with e each instrument. They say they find it very moving. The harpsichord never ever shouts at anybody. It only ever speaks. As players, we have the privilege of being able to participate, make music with them, and communicate their beautiful sounds to the audience sitting in the same room with us. So it's, a, it's, a, it's really a restoration of something from the past that gives us pleasure today in the present. The instruments are the, the stable point in all of that. We're just a female. There's just something wonderful about, there's a singing quality to them. I think playing on them is, is just wonderful, and I think that for musicians, the joy is in playing them. I hope for audience that the, the joy is in listening and, and being able to, to see them.